Come one, come on. What better way to spend a nice summer day than go into the amusement park? These fun places seem to be everywhere around the world, offering all sorts of fun rides for all agents. Some rides can go really fast at record-breaking speeds while others go really high, and some even turn your body upside down when you least expect it going on. These rides can be a great way to release so much adrenaline as you scream at the top of your lungs. The highest is big of the ride. However, not every. Everything is fun and smiles at amusement parks. There have been moments in which a nice fun and filling rug and turned into a scary incident. In just a matter of seconds today, we're going to be looking at 10 of the scariest amusement park accidents. This video will make you think twice. Next time you decide to go on a ride, stay tuned all the way to number one and have a look at one accident that you'll find it hard to believe but unfortunately it is a very true event with all that said and done let's begin shall we number 10 slingshot at luna park france have you ever ridden the slingshot it seems like a fun and safe ride but wait until you watch this video or one of the robes of the ride snaps and sends the riders out of control the incident made the gauge bump into a column and breaking the leg of a 24-year-old woman who was inside the ride. The woman and her companion had to wait for an hour suspended in midair until firefighters finally came and pulled them down. The people in charge at Luna Park in southern France and said that they had never had an experience like this one. They believed the incident on the manufacturer claiming it was a malfunction of the elastic that was never supposed to snap. They even closed the ride for investigation. Can you imagine being on this ride of the moment of the incident? Luckily though no one died. But I'm sure the two people inside were really scared and would probably think twice before getting on another ride like this one. Number 9 Pendular Rack Alright, not all the accidents have to do with people who were inside the ride. Sometimes the victims are just in the wrong place at the wrong time. This is exactly what happened. Nasseria Rack back in 2015 when expected or walked past a moving frisbee in a pendulum style. Kind of ride this beat and strengthen the riots, and the man about 6 meters off the platform or the ride just kept going and gaining more speed. Some of the consequences of this incident. Boot a concussion bruised ribs, and a broken leg. Other than that, the man survived the accident. And to be honest, that's actually quite surprised. I honestly can't imagine what it'd be like to be hit by a ride like this one. And I can't help but wonder what in the world was this man doing here in the first place you're supposed to wait for your turn out of the right area. All right, in front of it, he was probably really excited to get on the ride. But I guess he now has, so wait a bit longer. Number 8. Stop Spin Ride Pakistan Now what's scarier than a top spin ride? Falling from the tough spin ride is the right answer. And the people from Karachi, Pakistan. I can tell you all about it. Begins 2018. A group of unlucky riders fell from a height of 12 meters after a ride malfunction in the Askari Amusement Park. One schoolgirl died and at least 18 other people were injured by this tragic incident. A lot of visitors did come to help the victims and they claimed the incident happened as a result of overloading the ride. Since after all, it was a free one. I guess it's hard to keep control of people when you let them go on a thrilling ride at no cost. We engineers at the park said they could not know for certain the reason of the accident, but park attendants claimed it was the park's fault and asked for it to be shut down for good. Even though it had only been open for a month, a scurry is Karachi's first amusement park ever. We hope no more incidents like this happen, so Pakistani people get to enjoy the fun and thrills of going on rides without having to worry about deadly incidents like this one, due to negligence. Number 7. The Blind Bender Canada back in the mid-80s and amused and parked in Canada became the scenario for the next accident in our lists. The name of this ride is the Mind Bender, which is a looping roller coaster in Galaxy Land at the West Edmonton Bow in Alberta. Canada Energy started when the fourth car, one of the trains, derailed and slid backwards, which made it get out of control and ended up hitting a concrete pillar. The impact of the crash made four passengers fall from a height of about seven meters of the floor. Right below three of the passengers died while the fourth one was treated for severe injuries. Another 19 people were also hurt by this and had to be taken to a nearby hospital as a result. Its park authorities decided to make some changes, including making the train smaller, which in results reduced the capacity of riders that it could hold after all the incident was blamed on poor maintenance and design. So it makes sense that they decided to improve those two factors. After the deadly event, Number 6 Topspin Sheena, Natalie, 
And here's another incident that happened at 8 Hobson Ride. Man, this video is really making me stay away from these things. This time, the incident plays in a Chinese amusement park. Someone actually has footage of it. This can be a really tough video to watch, so viewer discretion is advised in this video. You can see how people are enjoying their ride with no major threat sight. Suddenly a girl is seen flying out of her seat. But how come? She's the only one going through this after the incident. In some investigation, people came to realize that the poor girl was on a seat with a faulty seatbelt. A closer look at the ride. Just the lack of a backup safety assessment that should prevent riders from fully detaching themselves from the ride in the event of an accident like this one. If these belts are their only safety measure, I'm surprised they've only had one incident with a ride as strong as the top. Spin, you need more than a few straps to keep people attached to the ride. Number 5. Mission Space USA Now let's explore one of the most intense rides at a Disney park. I'm talking about Mission Space, which allows riders to experience what space travels look like and consider one of the most intense rides ever, and sometimes be so intense that people end up in the hospital. Today Mission Space has earned a spot on this list as one of those intense experiences. Actually, I ended up in someone losing their life. It was a four-year-old boy who was quite tall for his age. He passed the height requirements, but the ride was probably a bit too much for him to handle. The kid passed out during the ride and was taken to the hospital, so where he later died. But actually he's not the only one to go through this a year after his death. A middle-aged woman also died after an intense experience in mission space and tons of other people have ended up in the emergency. NC room with nausea, dizziness, and chest pain. As a result of their time in this controversial ride, I'm not a big fan of amusement parks in the first place, but after hearing about this, I think I'm going to keep my distance even more. Number 4. Wave Swingers, Spain I always wonder what would happen to the swings if a wave swinger ever came off. I mean in order for this ride to be saved. Those seeds need to be properly attached and need to be able to take a lot of weight to stay clear from any incidents. Sadly in 2007, yeah, a woman fell from a wave swinger in Spain. This happened as the two chains that were holding her swing snapped off from her ride. She suffered an unfortunate concussion and got two broken legs as a result of the impact. The accident was blamed on poor maintenance of the park. The Wave Swinger is one of the most popular carnival rides ever, which means they've existed for quite a long time. By now, I guess that just means you can't expect those chains to work properly for that long. They definitely need some maintenance, so make sure you don't get on rides that are too old, unless they've been properly taken care of. Number 3 is the Read the Disco Dancer, India. Working at an amusement park. Sounds like a lot of fun, doesn't it? One of the cool jobs is that you can be one of the first people that try new rides, especially during your breaks. This is 120 workers that this amusement park decided to do during their free time. When they jumped on this ride called the Disco Dancer, unfortunately, what was supposed to be a fun and short break ended up in tragedy when the spinning wheel. This ride, which is where riders stand, came down and crashing from a height of about 5 meters above ground. It's not just the hype of the speed and the spinning movement of the ride that turned this into a chaotic moment. One of the workers died while seven others were injured. This led to the arrest of the park's owner and a manager under charges of negligence that turned into the death of a fellow worker. The disco dancer was one of the main attractions of the park. But it had stopped operations and floods down, damaged it. The workers were doing a test run before opening again to the public. Number 2 20 meters high drop USA One of the accidents at the top of this list is the very sad story of a woman who fell from more than 20 meters down to her death. The unfortunate incident happened at the Six Flags over Texas Park in Arlington. She fell down to her death after the ride's first ascent. The 52-year-old woman was not properly strapped to the ride which made her slip out of the vehicle while her children were watching it. Her daughter and son desperately wanted to jump out of the ride and get help for their mom. As soon as the ride came to a full stop, other park visitors claimed the lady had expressed some safety concerns prior to starting the ride. They say she felt that she was not properly secured. As the coaster was about to take off, there is a woman who was in line and witnessed the terrible accident. She says that everyone's bell clicked three times. Well, the victims only clicked once she asked that this was okay and the staff said yes. And no wonder she fell off. I guess this is a good lesson for staff at amusement parks. 
Always listen to the riders and never underestimate their safety concerns. I saved the best for last. First I have a quick challenge that takes 5 seconds. If you can live a life described within the next 5 second, you'll get 10 years of amazing luck. Just try it. It really works. Number 1. Haunted Castle at Six Flags, Great Adventure USA. I can tell you that rides a day are safer than ever. Why is that? Because park owners and managers have learned from mistakes from the past to make the safest rides we have today. At least most of them do. Hopefully let me tell you. Even though, even though the 80s seem like a lot of fun, they definitely don't look like the best years for amusement parks. So many incidents happen in this decade, including the one at the top of our list. A fire at the Haunted Castle and Six Flags. Great adventure. The fire. It started on the evening of May 11, 1984, and it was fanned by the air conditioning system. About 29 visitors were inside the attraction and a witness claimed she saw the fire as she walked inside but she thought it was part of the experience. It all changed when people started yelling fire and they had to evacuate. Unfortunately, a group of 18 majors died by one of their friends survived and was taken to a park nearby to calm down and receive proper medical attention. Other survivors had to be treated for smoke inhalation later. Investigations came to uncover that the building didn't have proper permits, a certificate of occupancy or even fire and smoke detectors. This tragic event made neighboring similar attractions to be shut down and be inspected before continuing operations while it's very sad. I guess it takes a terrible event like this for people to take safety matters a bit more seriously and rest in peace. The people who have lost their lives because of it. Which of these do you think is the scariest? And what's the scariest? And user park experience you've had let us know in the comments section below. And that's our video for the day. Folks, I hope you enjoyed it. I will. See you next time later. Everybody.